guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be starting a series or a bunch of essence videos for you. I'm absolutely loving everything that they are bringing out, all their new products, um, all their dupes and everything that they have recently launched. So I'm going to be doing a series or a few consecutive essence videos so as you can see I have a full face of makeup except eyes on and that's because in today's video I am going to be doing an eye look using the create and transform eye palette now I don't know if this is still available. Um, this came in a trend edition. There were three. There was a lip, an eye, and a face palette. I got the eye palette. Um, and I have indulged in this palette a little bit, as you can see. Um, it is a bunch of warm and cool tones, a lot of pinks, purples, and blues. Um, there's a lot of shimmers and a lot of nudes. Um, as well as these three shades here that were like the highlight of the palette, which they called Transformers. So you can put them on top of different um, eyeshadow, like matte colors, and it would form a shimmer, or you could use it as a brow bone highlight or an inner corner highlight. Um, or I suppose you could use it as your own highlight. Um, I do have my Mermaid highlight on today, so we could put some over and try it out. Um, so I thought I would just use this palette and show you a cool toned look. So it says um, an eye palette with silky and soft textures to create unique eye looks with endless possibilities. Features 17 trendy eyeshadows, <clears throat> two eyebrow powders and three gold and prismatic transformers to add on top of your eyeshadows to give them an extremely um, Sorry, to give them an extraordinary twist. Contains two brushes to apply your eyeshadows, create your own magic. So now I didn't realize there was eyebrows um, in here too, which I am taking it are those two because they are the transformers and they are the eyebrow shades. So that's quite cool. I've been using them as eyeshadow colors, but nevertheless. Um, so yeah, it did come with a, uh, like a plastic sleeve over that told you what was what. I don't know what I've done with it um, and it did come with two brushes but I never ever use um, brushes from an eyeshadow palette so let's jump straight into this eye tutorial okay so to prime my lids I have already used the stay all day long-lasting concealer from Essence this is my favorite one and it goes with the um, foundation in this range as well Okay, so to set that concealer, I'm going to go in with this matte shade here. It's a gorgeous, like, uh, beige shade. And this is just very nice to set your um, concealer because it is matte. Then on a fluffy brush, I am going to be picking up this pink shade over here for my transition shade um, it is also a beautiful matte and I'm just going to pop that with my essence um, I blend a brush into the crease okay so this is a very um, light pink um, I don't think it's not pigmented, I just think it's the lightness of the shade. There, it's buildable, I can see it building a bit. And then on a smaller fluffier brush, I'm going to go in with this little bit of a darker pink and also pop that into my crease. this brown on the same brush which is actually apparently an eyeshadow color I mean eyebrow shade um, I'm going to also dust that into my crease giving it just a little bit of a darker definition the pink is still shining through it's just more defined <sighs> 
Okay, so this eyebrow shade is obviously for a blonde. And then the darker one is for a brunette. There is a bit of fallout on here. And this could be because it is an eyebrow shade. And then I'm going to delve into this darker brown over here. There is a little bit of shimmer in this um, shadow, but it's still beautiful for the crease and a tad bit on the outer corner. Just blend it all together. And then with a flat eyeshadow brush, I'm going to dive into this dark blue over here. And I'm going to pack that on the outer corner of my eye. And you can just pop it into a little bit into the crease as well. I like to use a patting motion when I use darker colors and then blend it from there. I'm just going in with a small fluffy brush and just blending that blue out. We can pack a tiny bit more. Okay, I really actually like that blue color a lot. There is no fallout from that blue shade, only a little bit from the brown shade. Then I'm gonna dive into this purple color. It looks beautiful, but I'm going to use my finger and I'm just gonna swirl it around in there. And I'm just gonna pack this on the middle of my eyelid um, or the center of my eyelid. And just blend the blue and the purple together. You can see the purple is obviously a bit more opaque, so it is going over the blue. But we will um, fix that just now. That's really, really pretty. These shades are really pigmented. Um, I'm just going to go back in with that flat brush a little bit into the blue and just blend into that purple and then obviously use the fluffy brush to just blend that all together. Okay, and then on a clean um, eyeshadow brush, if I can find one. I am going to dive into this gorgeous shimmering pink over here. Um, this is a really pretty shade. And I'm just gonna pack that from the purple to my inner corner. It almost has a gradient effect. Um, this is also quite a pigmented shade. I really really like this look okay so obviously we have to try these transformers out because these are like one of the big things in the palette um actually you know what I'm going to go into this I'm going to go into this purple over here as well the shimmery purple and just pack that on over the pink as well And then we can also dip back into that purple and just do three or four pats here so we don't lose that beautiful purple. Okay, and then the Transformers are like the star of the show. So obviously we have to use those as well. So on a brow light brush, I am going to use this shade over here. And pack this underneath my eyebrow. Oh, that's pretty. And 
And then with that same shade, I'm going to use that in the inner corner of my eye. Okay, and then just to blend this all together, I am just going to take a little bit of that purple, I think, and I'm just going to dust it underneath my eyes. Um, with a shader brush or whatever this thin brush that you guys can use. Okie dokes, and I think our eyes are done. So I'm going to go in with my extreme long lasting 16 hour pencil. I really wish they still had these, but they don't. Um, this is just a gray. That is really nice for your waterline. And then for mascara, my very well used Lash Princess, my absolute favorite mascara. I cannot find a high end, a drugstore, and anything other mascara that matches this mascara. This is just my favorite, favorite, favorite mascara. Okay, so I have messed a tad bit there, but just let it dry and then you just dust it off with a brush. Um, and then just to try out for fun, I want to go in with these three and just dust my fan brush over them. And use them on top of my highlighter. Just be careful you do not pick up the darker shades, <laughs> otherwise that will be a disaster. That looks quite nice it's very subtle but it's very nice and then to end this look um, I'm gonna go in with my hollow Wow dewy lip shine in the shade number one unicorn powder And that is it for my create and transform eye look palette I really enjoyed this palette I think the color payoff and the pigment of these eyeshadows is really beautiful and I love the fact that they are eyebrow shades as well as those transformers slash highlighters slash pres prismatic um, shadows and I think you can get many many looks out of this so I just did this cool tone look today just to use some of the colors as well as the browns but I would love to do other looks and show you what they look like um, and I also really love this um, lippy but I really hope you enjoyed this video and if you did please don't forget to give it a thumbs up you can also share your looks with me if you have this palette and let me know how you found it um, please don't forget to subscribe as well as hit that like button and I'll see you in my next essence video bye